today topic is aromatic nucleophilic substitution aromatic nucleophilic substitution reactions are very important and can occur in the aromatic system by involving certain conditions now we will discuss aromatic nucleophilic substitution these reaction occur in three ways in the aromatic system one the first one is the direct substitution involving benzene intermediate here we will substitute the hydrogen by nucleophile the second way is aromatic addition elimination reactions these addition elimination reaction occur involving the activating uh, the groups which will activate the ring like electroimide drawing groups and the third one is the diazonium reactions the conversion of ring into diazonium salt that is very important and this diazonium chemistry is uh, you can uh, observe that produces variety of product now the first one nucleophilic aromatic substitution and these reaction involve the benzene you, here you can see that the x is a nucleophile this x nucleophile can be replaced with another nucleophiles like nu the nu will attack on the position carbon number 1 and replaces the x and this substitution cannot be directly possible if possible then this reaction will proceed via sn2 mechanism here this substitution is not possible since the for sn2 to happen the nucleophile should approach the carbon 1 c6 h5 y from behind but the position is very hindered so it would not happen therefore we uh, carry out this reaction involving the benzene intermediate the first of all the leaving group x is not directly substituted the first one the base will substitute or uh, remove the hydrogen atom from benzene or proton creating a negative charge from the benzene ring and this negative charge can be stabilized as converting into benzene the x leaving group depart out the intermediate benzene is formed this benzene is very reactive and can react with the nucleophile so that nucleophile uh, will takes the position of x and produces the nucleophilic substitution product we observe that this nucleophilic substitution product is carried only with the involvement of benzene and it works in a very harsh condition forming intermediate benzene like very high temperature of 300 degree centigrade and a very high pressure of 300 atm therefore this reaction is difficult to carry out the another way is nucleophilic aromatic substitution and this nucleophilic aromatic substitution involves the addition elimination here we will the nucleophilic substitution carried out the Uh, activating the groups these activating groups for nucleophilic substitution reaction usually include the electron withdrawing groups these electron withdrawing groups how will activate you see here that it is easier uh, path compared to benzene but difficult without activation this activation is carried with the help of electron withdrawing group like nitro group this nitro group will withdraw electron from the benzene ring so that the nucleophile oh will attack at the position of x that is para position and therefore this electron will go to the ortho position the electron withdrawing group further creates the negative charge on the carbon nitrogen or cn bond here and the finally it is get stabilized by the resonance you can see here the in the last step the electron will attack on the para position and leaving group x will depart out so that the nucleophilic substitution is carried with the presence of nitro group or electron withdrawing group in this way the nucleophilic substitution is easier thus we can say that the nucleophilic substitution of aromatic uh, ring can be carried in the presence of strong electron withdrawing groups and this strong electron withdrawing group 
carried out addition elimination reaction even at room temperature now the third way in which the nucleophilic aromatic substitution reaction carried is for involving the diazonium chemistry first what is the diazonium salt the diazonium salt is uh, consisting of the nitros uh, nitrous acid when combined with the primary amine so first of all the sodium nitrite is react with hcl to produce nitrous acid the nitrous acid react with further hcl here the protonation occur and this protonation will convert oh group into good leaving group that is the water the water will leave out and the nitrosonium ion no positive ion is formed this no positive ion is very reactive it can react with aniline or simple primary amine and this primary amine or aniline when react with nitroson nitrosonium ion here you can see that in the first step the proton leaves out and nitroso nitrosamine is formed and this nitrosamine is further converted after proton shifting into the the hydroxyl nitrosamine and the finally it will depart the water converted into diazonium ion this diazonium ion contain the uh, the benzene ring having a nitrogen triple bondedly with positively charge and this diazonium is very reactive species and this nitrogen even leaved out at a very low temperature of 0 to 5 degree and when it will leave out it will produces the aromatic ring or aryl cation this aryl cation can be substituted with variety of nucleophile to give the nucleophilic substituted product you can here observe that if this nitro free nitrogen will leave out in the gaseous form this aryl cation can be substituted with nucleophile like nu oh cl negative f negative or any other nucleophile to give a variety of product now we can see that uh, one by one the different type of nucleophile that can substitute like the copper chloride will produces the chloride ion the copper bromide will produces bromide ion and copper cyanide well produces nitrile ion here these ion can be replaced the nit free nitrogen to produce bromobenzene chlorobenzene or even the benzene nitrile similarly fluoroborates react with diazonium salt to produce fluoromenzene and it react with the potassium iodide the iodo group will leave out the nitrogen and produces the iodobenzene as well you can see that water is very weak nucleophile or even neutral substance this water can also remove the free nitrogen and produces the phenol and the metaphosphoric acid is also very weak acid it can react with diazonium salt to even produce the benzene back now in summary in this lecture you have observed that the direct nucleophilic aromatic substitution is very difficult to perform without harsh condition even you can see here the benzene intermediate formed which is very unstable the presence of electron withdrawing group or simply the group that will activate the ring can carry out aromatic substitution easily and the diazonium chemistry that is very important and it help to achieve nucleophilic aromatic substitution more easily with variety of product so thus you can see that the aromatic nucleophilic substitution can be easily carried out by producing the diazonium product thank you very much for further reading